the Psalms of Morning Prayer for Monday of the 24th week in Ordinary Time and the Feast of the Triumph of the Cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall proclaim your praise. To destroy the power of hell, Christ died upon the cross. Clothed in strength and glory, he triumphed over death. Psalm 63. O God, you are my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory, for your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed, I remember you. On you, I muse through the night, for you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. Your right hand holds me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. To destroy the power of hell, Christ died upon the cross. Clothed in strength and glory, he triumphed over death. A reading from the book of Hebrews, chapter 2. We see Jesus crowned with glory and honor because he suffered death, that through God's gracious will he might taste death for the sake of all men. Indeed, it was fitting that when bringing many sons to glory, God, for whom and through whom all things exist, should make their leader in the work of salvation perfect through suffering. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God our Father, in obedience to you, your only Son accepted death on the cross for the salvation of mankind. We acknowledge the mystery of the cross on earth. May we receive the gift of redemption in heaven. We ask this through our Lord, Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Psalms of Morning Prayer is brought to you by the Confraternity of Penitents, penitents.org. I'm David Rollins. Join us weekdays as we continue to pray from the unceasing and universal prayer of the whole people of God, the Liturgy of the Hours.